flop this morning, and I can't argue with the man. I, I can see where we're coming from. Some really nice bands ripping across southern and uh, central Maine, 8 to 12 along the coastline, 6 to 8. Mountains should be good for 4 to 6 inches of snow. After that, man, our pattern is locked in quite a way. We've got winter level 11 is what I'm calling it. Today's storm comes on through. You can see it there, that bowling ball of a low. We get another little light disturbance on Saturday. That's good for one to three inches of snow. And then another storm comes in Sunday night, Monday. The computer models want this to be a big deal. We'll have to watch it. We're several days away, but I'll tell you that the European model has basically a blizzard level event along the coastline there. And another storm possible on Thursday. Shades of 2015 here where we will lock into a pattern for a couple of weeks that does all of the work snowfall wise for us. So we got a break tomorrow. It's cold though. More snow one to three on Saturday. Let's watch Sunday night, Monday again. That is a big storm threat. It's a big low. It's sitting out there. It's got a lot of moisture to work with. And once we get through that, then maybe we'll talk about what could or could not happen for Wednesday night and into Thursday. But there's no question that we are into one of these patterns in which we're on the right storm track. The jet stream is in the right position, and we may get ourselves into quite a bit of snow here over the next seven days. So, Cindy, take it for what it is. I think the way things are lining up the next seven days, it's better to be like the kids were before and uh, embrace the snowfall. Jeff, 